Have you ever wondered how much your diet can impact your kidney health? If you're dealing with kidney issues, you must have heard of GFR or glomerular filtration rate. It is basically a measure of how well your kidneys are filtering waste from your blood. If GFR is low, it indicates declined kidney function, and it is important to improve it. So, in today's video, we will walk you through a proven diet to boost kidney function by 45 GFR points. We will explain everything from what foods to eat, what to avoid, and how these changes can help you improve your kidney health. Let's begin. First, let's discuss kidney function and the role of GFR. This will help you understand the video in a better way. Kidney function is vital for overall health, as the kidneys play a central role in maintaining the body's balance of fluids, electrolytes, and waste. Every day, they filter around 200 liters of blood and remove waste products and excess substances like sodium, potassium, and urea, which are then excreted in urine. This filtration process is essential for keeping the body's internal environment stable, regulating blood pressure, and supporting red blood cell production by releasing the hormone erythropoietin. A key indicator of kidney function is the glomerular filtration rate, or GFR, which, as mentioned earlier, measures how well your kidneys are filtering waste from your blood. A healthy GFR typically ranges between 90 and 120 milliliters per minute. As GFR decreases, it indicates a loss of kidney efficiency. When GFR drops below 60 milliliters per minute, it indicates chronic kidney disease. A GFR under 15 can point to kidney failure, which requires dialysis or a transplant. Lower GFR levels can result in the buildup of harmful toxins, causing symptoms like fatigue, swelling, high blood pressure, and imbalanced electrolytes, all of which can severely impact heart and bone health. Therefore, keeping GFR within a healthy range is crucial to avoid these complications and protect overall health. Now let's explore some proven diets that support kidney health and boost GFR. Number one, plant-based diet. A plant-based diet is one of the most effective ways to support kidney health and boost your GFR. This diet includes whole and nutrient-rich foods like fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, and nuts. These foods are good for kidneys because they are naturally lower in sodium, phosphorus, and saturated fats, compounds that can strain your kidneys. At the same time, they are packed with essential nutrients, antioxidants, and fiber that help reduce inflammation and oxidative stress, two of the leading causes of kidney damage. For this, vegetables like spinach, bell peppers, cauliflower, and cabbage are particularly beneficial as they are low in potassium and phosphorus, which makes them easier on your kidneys while being high in vitamins and minerals. Moreover, fruits such as blueberries, strawberries, and apples are rich in antioxidants, which protect your kidneys from damage and help lower inflammation. And whole grains and legumes, like quinoa and lentils, provide plant-based protein that's gentler on your kidneys compared to animal proteins. So, to improve your kidney health, opt for a plant-based diet. For this, aim to make vegetables and fruits about half of your plate at each meal, reduce meat, and opt for plant proteins like beans or tofu a few days a week, and include a variety of vegetables, especially kidney-friendly options, in your meals, and snack on antioxidant-rich fruits like berries. Number 2. Low-Sodium Diet A low-sodium diet is essential for maintaining kidney health and improving GFR. This is because high sodium intake can lead to fluid retention, which increases the volume of blood in circulation. This added volume can raise blood pressure and put additional strain on the kidneys. Over time, high blood pressure can damage the delicate blood vessels in the kidneys and degrade their ability to filter waste effectively. This cycle of increased pressure and fluid retention can lead to further kidney damage and decreased function. Reducing sodium intake is especially important for individuals with chronic kidney disease, or CKD, as it helps alleviate pressure on the kidneys and help improve their functioning. So, this is why a low-sodium diet can help you improve your kidney function and GFR. The daily allowed intake of sodium is around 2,300 milligrams. However, people with chronic kidney disease or having any other kidney issues must keep their sodium intake below 1,500 milligrams per day. For this, you can avoid processed snacks, canned meals, fast food, and deli meats as they are all high in sodium, and start eating fresh, healthy, and whole foods 
that have a low sodium content by nature, like apples, bananas, carrots, potatoes, and spinach. Also, be sure to read food labels carefully. Choose items with low sodium or no salt added, and replace table salt with other herbs and spices for flavoring and cooking, as it is very high in sodium. Number three, fiber-rich diet. A diet high in fiber can greatly improve kidney function in many ways, especially for people with chronic kidney disease. First, fiber forms a gel-like substance in the gut, binds all wastes and harmful substances, regulates bowel movements, and helps the body eliminate toxins through feces, which reduces the harmful substances that can re-enter the bloodstream. This process reduces the strain on kidneys as they do not have to work harder to remove large amounts of waste. Second, fiber also plays a vital role in promoting healthy gut bacteria. When you consume plenty of fiber, beneficial bacteria flourish in the gut. These bacteria produce short-chain fatty acids, or SCFAs, during fermentation, which offer numerous health benefits, including reducing inflammation and strengthening the gut barrier. By lowering inflammation throughout the body, fiber indirectly supports kidney health. Research shows that higher fiber intake is associated with reduced levels of inflammatory markers, such as C-reactive protein. For instance, CKD patients who increase their total fiber intake by just 10 grams per day experience a 38% reduction in high CRP levels. Additionally, dietary fiber can help manage other conditions that increase the risk of CKD, such as high blood pressure and diabetes. Despite these benefits, many people with CKD do not meet the recommended daily fiber intake of 25 to 38 grams. Due to this, they face many health issues. So, to increase your fiber intake, start your day with a high-fiber breakfast like oatmeal or bran cereal, and add at least three servings of fruits and vegetables to your meals and snacks. Add legumes such as beans, lentils, and chickpeas to soups and salads, and choose whole grains like whole grain bread, pasta, and brown rice instead of refined options. Number four, low protein diet. Protein is an essential nutrient for building and repairing tissues, but for individuals with CKD, too much protein can be harmful and eventually it can decrease GFR. This is because when the body metabolizes protein, it produces waste products that the kidneys must filter out. In people with chronic kidney disease, the kidneys are less capable of handling this waste so it leads to a buildup of toxins in the blood. Over time, this can further damage the kidneys and worsen CKD. So the key to managing your kidney health is through diet and with the right balance of protein intake. It is not necessary to eliminate protein entirely, but it's important to reduce intake, especially from animal sources. For this, instead of a high protein-based diet, eat plant-based proteins, such as beans, lentils, and tofu in your daily routine. These foods are easier for the kidneys to process and provide additional nutrients like fiber and antioxidants that boost your overall kidney function and increase your GFR. It is proven that limiting protein intake to about 10% of daily calories is beneficial for your kidneys to function more efficiently and reduce the risk of further damage. Number five, low phosphorus diet. Phosphorus is a mineral found in many foods and is essential for various body functions, including bone health and energy production. However, when the kidneys are not functioning properly, they struggle to eliminate excess phosphorus from the blood. This can lead to high phosphorus levels, which can cause serious health issues, including bone disease and cardiovascular problems. One of the key reasons to reduce phosphorus intake is to prevent the buildup of this mineral in the bloodstream. High levels of phosphorus can lead to the release of calcium from bones, weakening them and increasing the risk of fractures. Additionally, raised phosphorus levels are associated with an increased risk of heart disease, which makes it important for those with kidney issues to monitor their phosphorus consumption closely. So, to follow a low phosphorus diet, focus on foods that are naturally low in phosphorus, such as fresh fruits and vegetables, rice, and certain grains. Limit or avoid high phosphorus foods, which often include dairy products, nuts, seeds, beans, whole grains, and processed foods containing phosphate additives. Moreover, read food labels carefully as many processed foods can contain hidden phosphorus. Number six, Mediterranean diet. The Mediterranean diet is a nutritious eating pattern that focuses on whole, nutrient-dense foods. 
It is known for its heart-healthy benefits and can be especially beneficial for individuals with chronic kidney disease. This diet focuses on the consumption of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, nuts, and healthy fats, particularly olive oil. A key feature of the Mediterranean diet is its focus on fresh, seasonal ingredients. These include fruits and vegetables packed with antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals. These nutrients help lower inflammation and oxidative stress, which can harm the kidneys. So, by including a variety of fruits and vegetables in your meals, you ensure that your kidneys receive the essential nutrients they need to work well. Whole grains and legumes are also important components of this diet. They provide a good source of dietary fiber, which as mentioned earlier, supports digestive health and helps regulate blood sugar and cholesterol levels. This is particularly important for individuals with conditions like diabetes or high blood pressure, which can worsen kidney issues. Healthy fats are also important in the Mediterranean diet. These include olive oil and fatty fish, like salmon, which are high in omega-3 fatty acids. These fats have anti-inflammatory properties and are good for heart and cardiovascular health. Keeping your heart healthy is essential for overall kidney function because the heart and kidneys work together closely. Moreover, the Mediterranean diet encourages limiting red and processed meats, added sugars, and refined grains. Reducing these unhealthy foods can lower the strain on kidneys because they do not have to work harder and helps in better weight management and lower blood pressure, which further alleviates stress on the kidneys. So, to improve your kidney health, adopt a Mediterranean diet. For this, add more fruits and vegetables to your meals, choose whole grains over refined options, and use olive oil as your healthy source of fat. It is generally recommended to consume one tablespoon of olive oil per day. However, do not consume whole grains and beans in excess because they are high in phosphorus, which can negatively affect your kidneys. Number seven, antioxidant-rich diet. One major cause of kidney damage is oxidative stress, which occurs when free radicals, the unstable molecules, begin to accumulate in the body. These free radicals can damage cells and tissues throughout the body, including kidneys, which contributes to inflammation and further worsens kidney problems. The kidneys can become overburdened by this damage, especially in individuals with already compromised renal function. Free radicals can not only damage healthy kidney cells, but also exacerbate existing issues, leading to a decrease in the glomerular filtration rate. This is where antioxidants help. They neutralize free radicals, protect kidney cells from further damage, and support overall kidney health. As mentioned earlier, fruits and vegetables are some of the best sources of antioxidants. Berries, in particular, are rich in flavonoids and vitamin C, both powerful antioxidants that help fight oxidative stress. So, include a cup of blackberries, raspberries, strawberries, and blueberries in your diet several times a week to support kidney function. In addition to berries, fatty fish like salmon and mackerel, which contain omega-3 fatty acids, also provide anti-inflammatory benefits. Other antioxidant-rich foods that can enhance kidney health include olive oil, fresh greens, red bell peppers, carrots, and apples. Number eight, gluten-free diet. A gluten-free diet can be beneficial for individuals with certain health conditions, including those with kidney issues. Gluten is a protein found in wheat, barley, and rye, and can cause inflammation in some people, particularly those with gluten sensitivity or celiac disease. This inflammation can contribute to kidney stress and may worsen existing kidney conditions. For people with chronic kidney disease or other kidney-related issues who have gluten sensitivity or celiac disease, adopting a gluten-free diet can help reduce inflammation and improve overall kidney function. By eliminating gluten-containing foods, they can experience lower inflammatory responses, which ease the burden on kidneys and help to improve glomerular filtration rates. If you opt for a gluten-free diet, focus on nutrient-dense, whole foods, and choose naturally gluten-free grains like quinoa, brown rice, and millet, which provide essential nutrients without the negative effects of gluten. Moreover, adding a variety of fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and healthy fats to your meals will help ensure you receive adequate nutrition while avoiding gluten. However, be cautious with processed gluten-free products, as they can often be high in sodium, sugars, and unhealthy fats. Always check labels and select products that are low in these harmful ingredients. 
Moreover, if you are considering a gluten-free diet, consult with a healthcare professional or a registered dietitian. They can help you determine whether this diet is beneficial for your specific condition and assist you in creating a balanced meal plan tailored to your needs. And there you have it, some proven diets to boost kidney function and improve GFR. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like it and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. See you in the next video.